Greetings from the Yerikos, this is Mad Shad. And this is my uh, my small little uh, gun show prepper haul. Why is it doing that? There we go. <laughs> well, for one, we got Charity here, and she is she has already claimed the poncho liner, which is amazing. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Charity. <laughs> She's not to be disturbed when she has her her uh uh her thing. So uh yeah, here we go. They had these little things. Little uh, MREs broken down, which I like to do anyway. Five bucks. Boom. You know, great pair of knee pads, slightly used, five bucks. Uh, I've been looking for one of these for a long, you know, long time. You know what this is? Canteen cup holder stove. Okay. Badass. That thing is badass. Uh, oh yeah. I got a cat for five bucks. Five bucks. It's a cat. A cat tourniquet. Uh, and I got a little, uh, what is this thing? A little, little baklava. That's a good little piece of gear. Uh, very soaky. And I got a little sniper's veil. Uh, I think that and that was like five bucks. A wool blanket. McGuire. Yeah. 80% uh, wool, 20% man made. Um, <laughs> these are always fun. You guys know what that is. Uh, little helmet uh, insulated thing. These are super warm if you, if you don't know what these are. Uh, get them five bucks. It was badass. Um, uh, talked about the poncho liner, yeah. Uh, a camelback bladder, a cam 10, 10 bucks, a camelback bladder and carrier for like I think it was like 12 bucks. What the hell, really amazing. Uh, <laughs> t shirts. Well, the t-shirts were about 15 bucks, but, uh, I, uh, I got a couple anyway. I'm giving them to my friends. And probably the most expensive piece of gear that I bought was a, uh, a very simple, uh, 85 bucks for a plate carrier. Uh, what's their names? Uh, they're made here in, uh, in Ohio. Uh, who are these guys? Yeah. CQMA. There you go. Bruised but still breathing. He also had helmets too. Uh, but the helmets were like $450. Uh, I was actually looking for a helmet. But yeah, and it's, it's got the quick release and all that. It, it came with a, uh, you know, a uh, complimentary magazine pouch, which comes, it can rip off, uh, Velcro off. But, uh, oh, oh, and a charity. A charity. Yeah. Unfortunately, I was looking for dog stuff. No dog gears. Yeah. Didn't see any dog gear. Yep. But yeah, just a few things. Uh. Just a few little items. <laughs> yeah. What do you think? What do you think, Charity? Yeah. The sniper veil. Oh, yeah. This thing, 1,001 uses, guys. Let me tell you something. This thing is amazing. If you've never really used one, look. You can see through it. <laughs> and all it, ha all it takes, oh, this is what it takes. Boom. I've already been subdued. And you can also take this thing and hang it up on a window. Or a blind or something, a tree. You can make your own blind out of that. Uh, of course, in, conjun in conjunction with a bunch of other stuff I have, uh, camo netting. Uh, they had some ghillie suits that were pretty uh, pretty interesting for 60 bucks. I started to get one. Uh, Pre-made ghillie suits. But uh, yeah, I decided against it. Yeah, that's my little prepper haul from the gun show. Gear. I think I maybe spent uh, uh, like almost three hundred dollars, 
uh, yeah, yeah, about three hundred dollars. But I got some good gear, uh, good gear, good useful stuff. Here, let's not work on that. And a lot of this stuff was cheap. I mean, you know, that was kind of ex expensive. And the T-shirts were expensive, but that's the, about the only. You're you're always going to pay, you know, if not more for a uh, for a, a a plate carrier. You know, that's just just the way it is. And this is very simple stuff. Oh shit! It's got more more magazine pouches on the side. Cool. Very cool. But yeah, I just thought I'd give you a little. <laughs> I had fun at the gun show. So, yes, tonight uh, we'll be doing uh, Domer Meth Ox Trial by Axe, the game. <laughs> the game. Uh, I think I got it all figured out, uh, and uh, it's going to be pretty, pretty fun. Um, and the, uh, the, our, the one being accused is a, is a fink. He's definitely a fink. Uh, a guy named Larry. Yeah. So he's on the chopping, he's on the, uh, on the axe wall. Oh, uh, I started to buy an axe too. They had a cricket, uh, Viking axe, but he wanted way too much for it. He wanted like 70 bucks. You know, it had a little short handle on it. Nah. I kind of wanted to get it anyway. And I was going to put my own handle on it, <laughs> you know, make it war ready. But, uh, yeah, anyway. Oh, shit. I found a 20. I saved more money than I thought. Very good. So, actually, yeah. Wow. So in that case, less than $300. 280 Yeah. I forget how much the... Uh, most things were like 15 20 bucks. But, yeah, it adds up, you know. It adds up. So, it's been Mad Shad and... Charity... Encouraging you all to continue to train, continue to prep, because we all know it's a mad, mad world out there.